episode, uh, our Lex, which is Lex2049. Uh, we are from group 46. Uh, today, we will discuss about the, our title, which is food that we have to put in our news. So, anyone have any... So, anyone introduce. have... Introduce. Uh, oh. uh, 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 introduce uh, uh, yourself first. My name is Ika Danti Binti Misdar. My magic number is 199193. Hello. Hello. My name is uh, Nur Farah Hanim. My magic number is 197376. Next. Hello. My name is Sarah Amira Shafiza Binti Muhammad Zain Hussein. My magic number is 199007. Hello, my name is Dalia Anwar. Uh, matrix number 198409. Hello, my name is Nuru Shazwani Binti Muhammad Rafa'in. Matrix number 198975. Hi, my name is Nur Amira Binti Mahazi. My matrix number 198949. Hello, my name is Farah Mimi My matrix number is 199127. Hi, my name is Sitana Alam Jusaini. My matrix number is 198323. Okay, we are done introduce ourselves. So now we have to start uh, the discussion. So I will share my screen first. <laughs> Did you guys see my screen? Yes. Okay, today uh I want to in uh, uh I want to introduce the news that I uh searched before which is uh this is from the insider.com. Uh they basically the this article is the title is how to tell if you have the food poisoning. <laughs> Um, so basically, uh, in this article, they, uh, they give the general idea and knowledge about the sign and the causes of the food poisoning. They also give the some tips to which is regarding about the signs of the food poisoning, uh, which is we know fever meeting and also they also stated the causes of the food poisoning that commonly happen which is first is undercooked food rotten food and contaminated food um basically uh in this uh news they also tell that food poisoning is a common uh illness that is can preventable which is can be avoided by practice the hygiene in the food making. So that's all from me. Hello. Okay. Um so next is my turn. Okay. Um so my article is um about foods that are incredibly filling. Um okay. Um, which means um, I'm going to introduce to you guys what are the foods that make us feel full and also um, feel um, full for a longer time. Okay. Um, what makes a food feeling? First, um, the food um, usually high in protein. Second, um, high in fiber. Third, high in volume, which means the foods uh, contain a lot of water, such as fruits, watermelon. Um, fourth, low in energy density, which is um, the foods um, that is low in calorie. So, first food is boiled potatoes. Okay. Mm. Second is eggs. Um, like we know eggs in high in protein. Um, third is oatmeal. Um, usually, uh, when we eat oatmeal um, during breakfast, um, it will help us um, to satisfy our hunger and 
feel uh, feel full um a bit longer until lunch or maybe dinner okay um fourth is fish fish also high in protein okay um five soups six meat meat um such as um, beef okay uh seven uh greek yogurt i don't know what is greek yogurt um maybe you guys can google after this eight is vegetables nine is cheese ten is um legume legume um wait uh this is legume um it is more like more like beans um 11 is fruit 12 is quinoa quinoa uh, quinoa uh, this is quinoa i think you guys um have saw this before um thirteen is nuts almonds such as almond walnuts 14 coconut oil 15 popcorn popcorn we eat um while during eh, while watching the movies all right that's all for me next the bbc news uh, untitled subways overtakes mcdonald as biggest restaurant change so recently uh uh all people in the world knows that mcdonald is the one of the is the largest food company in the world however recently it has been announced that subways has overtakes mcdonald as the biggest restaurant change uh, in the world Recently, the number of franchises that Subways uh, has come is 33,000, which is uh, more than the McDonald's, which is 32,000. So, it shows that uh, why is people uh, choose Subways over McDonald's? So, uh, that is why I'm interested in choosing this title because um, I think, in my opinion, in my point of view, people uh, choose Subway's over McDonald's because it uh, likely a more healthier food. Uh, it just contains the bread, the fresh salad such as vegetable, and also it is not uh, from a dairy product because some of dairy product may uh, detrimental to human health. So I think that Subway's is a good fast food. Uh, I, I'm not sure either Subway is included as a fast food or not because it is a fresh uh, sandwich meat. So I think people choose Subway over McDonald's because uh, people are now concerned about their health as McDonald's calories intake are likely higher than Subway. So I think this news uh, needed because it shows that people now are uh, uh, worried and concerned in uh, maintaining their health. So that's all from me. Okay, hello everyone. So basically this is my article chosen uh, in this discussion video. Um, it is about Malaysians go nuts over Malaysia Airlines peanuts. So um, we know that recently due to the pandemic situation, we are not able to fly anywhere that much anymore. And uh, however, Malaysia Airlines has provided its initiative in um, uh, recovering its famous uh, salted peanuts um, in which they sell online. So here's the picture of the peanuts that were sold out instantly. It's basically a gift box. And I think it is interesting because um, even though they've stopped functioning uh, quite actively recently, they still managed to uh, you know, start an initiative to continue their business by promoting their famous salted peanuts. And apparently it got sold out in just a few hours. Okay, so um, 
So from this, you can see how um, we can take a lesson whereby even in hard times, you can still manage to like uh, make the best out of something. For example, uh, the salted peanuts of Malaysia Airlines. And apparently there are still people who are willing to buy it and support the company. So uh, that's all from me. Can you guys see my screen? Still loading. Not yet. Can you see? Yes. yes. Uh, so, uh, for the news article that I found for the food section in our news publication is about a uh, woman lose 13 kg uh, in just 3 months using the Malaysia Healthy Plate Diet and her meal looks uh, surprisingly delicious. This news is published by Asia One on 13 March 2020. So, from this article, uh, this woman only uh, practice the Malaysia healthy plate, which is uh, eating the quarter, quarter, quarter half, uh, which, uh, where the half portion of the plate uh, is mainly the vegetable and of roots. Uh, the quarter of the plate is mainly from protein, and the other quarter is from uh, carbohydrate. So, uh, she just practice this uh, as her daily food, and she managed to lose weight until thirteen kg. So, what I want to say here, uh, to for us to uh, maintain a weight that is uh, within the normal, uh, the normal weight, we uh, we don't have to pressure ourselves to eat. Um, to eat just healthy snake, uh, but we also can enjoy uh, each portion uh, each, each portion by using this Malaysia healthy plate as our daily uh, daily food. So I think this is, uh, this can be an aspire, inspiring story for those who are trying to lose their weight uh, or reduce their food consumption. So they can uh, follow her, uh, follow her food intake uh, from this Malaysia healthy plate. So that's all from me. Okay, so hi guys, can you see my screen? Yes. yes. Okay, so today I want to share with you the news article from Rising Sun with the headline Healthy Snake Ideas and Food Swaps for Kids. Okay, so uh, since our theme today is food, I think this article is important to help the parents out there, especially the mummies. Um, to cook a healthy food uh, for their kids. Okay, this is because as you can see in this uh, news, uh, there are many lists of healthy snakes that parents that are suitable for kids. So, uh, the healthy snakes such as vegetable strips, rice cakes and homemade oats bar so since uh, now uh, since during this COVID-19 pandemic uh, our activities are very limited because we need to stay at home right so when we stay at home uh, we tend to eat eat and eat most of the time 
So I think these articles can help the mummies to cook a variety of healthy food instead of buying unhealthy snake like junk foods and sugary drinks. Okay, uh, and lastly, this healthy snake idea also can reduce the obesity on kids that are getting worse nowadays. So that's all from me. Yes, we can see, but we can't hear you, Omi. Hi, today I will discuss about writing on the healthy food train uh, published by the desktop. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, during the COVID-19 uh, pandemic, uh, people are more awareness about the healthy lifestyle. So, uh, Malaysia is, uh, is, home, is home for the uh, medic medicinal and health benefit can be used in natural remedies because of the tropical um, tropical place and then uh, there are many uh, many manufacturers uh, develop the product by using the herbs uh, we uh, produce uh, innovation healthy food like um, bar protein yogurt and cheese and uh, today's people uh, want to eat more but uh, but uh, they also concerned about the nutritional of the of the food mm. and then uh, so with the increasing awareness among consumers about the benefit of health ingredient the market for them is growing as a consumer, prefer balanced diet and food that not only satisfy their hunger but is also nutritional. So for me, thank you. Hello, can you see my screen? Yes. Okay, so um, today I'm going to share an article that I get from Healthline website, which is about 58 foods that contain almost zero calories. So uh, I believe that these days during this pandemic, everyone is staying at home, right? So I think everyone is gaining weight somehow. And I believe also <laughs> everyone is still struggling to lose some weight. And maybe some of us are practicing, some of us, some of us even maybe our readers are still practicing dieting. So I think this kind of article is kind of beneficial and informative for them to practice, um, you know, the right way of diet. Because this article um, says about 38 foods that contains almost zero calories, such as um, apple, watermelon, um, ready to create food and some more. So this kind of um, food that can, that is actually fulfilling but you know can cut down their calories each day. So you know like diet, eighty percent of the diet is actually from calories intake and twenty percent is from physical activity. So uh, I think this article is important. Um, that's all from me. So I believe that everyone already shared their uh, article of their choice. So um, 
all in all, we have to choose only two articles out of all. So uh, in my opinion, I think um, I would choose um, Hanim's article. It's about regarding food that is um, that is makes you that feel is, that is fulfilling, right? Can yes. be yeah, yeah. I think there's something like that. So, um, yeah, I think that one is good. What about others? In my opinion, I agree uh, to what Alia said just now. I think that her name's article has uh, interesting information about food that can help us um, feel full for quite a long time so that we do not um, eat junk food. So it can benefit us all, I think. Yes, uh, I also agree with Dalia and Alia, and I. Okay, I think. Okay, I think. Um, I interested interested in Dalia's articles, which is mass right about mass. Their yes, their penis. Yeah, yes. I think uh, Dalia articles can give motivation to the people out there who are still survive in the, during this COVID-19 pandemic. So uh, it is the best article to uh, tell the people out there to keep survive on what they want to do even in this pandemic. Yes, I agree with you, uh, Amira Mahazi, regarding the news that uh, represent by Dahlia uh, of the mass of the mass company airlines. Uh, I also agree that it is important to be included in our news since mass uh, is a company that is beneficial and important to Malaysia. So they have a very uh, high thinking and initi initiative uh, in order to struggling and surviving their company because we, all, we know that uh, airlines company are getting zeros, zeros uh, money due to the MCO. So uh, they are great in surviving so i think it is interested and should be included in our news hello okay. hello i think yes i also agree um to choose um dahlia's article and also my articles because first uh for dahlia's article i think it is interesting because i i find it I found it um interesting about the nuts. Um also um besides um we can inform our reader um to support the mass peanuts. Um second um about my article, I think also I also think it is inter interesting because um we can tell our readers what are the foods that help them to feel full um, and also this this thing can prevent them to in to eat um such a high calorie food okay so i think uh, we uh, uh, we are agree that the title that we have choose the news that we have chosen in to be included in our news uh, on the food section is from Farah Hanim's uh, news and Dalia's news, which is the food that food the food the food that is fulfilling and the the news regarding the mass peanuts. So. We agree with that decision. So, anyone want to add something about our 
Do we have a next video discussion? Yeah. I think yes. I think yes, we have um we need to make another meeting. Uh, for so we can us do it to uh, to do the art to do to publish the article like so, so I think for this week, that is all for our discussion. Yeah. Okay. See you next time. Thank you for your time. Thank Bye. you. Everyone. Thank you.